this plan is bad news for California taxpayers. Uh, it's bad news on, on, on two levels. Um, first of all, one of the issues that we've always said is because you happen to carry a card doesn't mean you have access. And this is only reinforced in this particular effort. The fact is that there are numerous expansions without any that are going to become the responsibility of states without any reimbursement. Not only that, but at that point, what, what does that do? That either does make, makes states do one of two things, either not cover them and deal with the issue of repercussions of that, or shift them to their own taxpayers. Well, the fact is, at the end of the day, you still need somebody to go see you when you get sick. There's not anything in this plan that helps us create more docs to see people. And in fact, some argue that less docs will be around with this plan. That's the key to access. And so that's bad for California taxpayers. They're going to get burdened with the idea of un the unfunded mandates. Taxpayers are going to have to make up that difference. And bad for taxpayers is the fact they think they're getting something. And in fact, it's an illusion. They're not getting the access to health care that, that they feel like they're promised. The other issue that I believe that, that is that has shifted to California taxpayers, and that's the issue of the special carve-outs. Why does one state get protection and another state has to pay for it? That to us is a great concern because when you give a benefit to whatever state you want to choose, and then you ask Californians to, to just kind of pay for it, that's a shift for them. That means you and I are paying a higher tax so that somebody else in some other state doesn't have to pay it. The tragedy of all of that, about all of that, is it was because we did it not because of good policy. We did it because of the politics necessary in order to get a vote. Californians should be out outraged that they were pawns in this process, used by legislators across not only this state but across this nation in order to get a vote of a bad health care system that ultimately is going to cost them more money and going to be supplemented by their tax dollars to another state. That's why this whole issue should be taken apart. We need to start over again. Instead of doing things to create opportunities, such as policies available over state lines, we did just the opposite with this particular effort. Instead of being able to give people more choices like medical savings accounts, they kept medical savings accounts. Less choice, more toward a government program that doesn't necessarily even guarantee any access. It's a bad plan all around for taxpayers.